Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. One of the most useful and fundamental functions of Word is the ability to add clip art and other types of pictures into your documents in order to enhance their appearance. Clip art is provided with Word, but you can also add your own saved images, or you can edit the properties of the clip art that is provided in order to customize the clip art. Word provides you with hundreds of images that you will find useful for enhancing your documents. In addition, you can download additional free clip art from Office.com. You can also import any independently purchased clip art or other types of picture files that you have available. You can insert clip art into a document easily. Simply click the Insert tab that appears in the ribbon, and then click the Clip Art button in the Illustrations group in order to display the clip art task pane at the right side of the Word application. In the clip art task pane at the right side of the application, you can search for clips that are related to any topic that you choose by typing the topic for which you want to search for associated clips into the search for text box. Now if you're using Word 2007, use the search in drop-down to choose where you wish to look for related clips. You can then check or uncheck any places that you want to search from the list shown. Then use the Results Should Be drop-down to choose the type of media for which you wish to search. Once again, check or uncheck any of the results shown. At that point, once you've made your desired choices, just click the Go button to search the selected locations for the type of media that you've selected. Now any related clips will then be displayed in the large scrollable window below the search criteria. You can then click on any of the clips shown in order to insert them into your documents. Now once you've finished inserting your clip art, you can click the small X in the upper right corner of the clip art task pane in order to close it. By default, when you add clip art or any other type of graphics into a Word document, it has a default text wrapping of in line with text. This means that the picture has been inserted into the document as if it were simply another character in a sentence. You will not be able to click and drag it into the center of the document, for example, unless you had characters within which you could cut and paste the actual image. So, you can change the text wrapping in order to move the image and bring it into a different layer than in line with text. So we just need to change the text wrapping first. Now once you change the text wrapping, then you can move the image by simply clicking and dragging the image to a different part of the document. To resize the image with your mouse, just start by placing your mouse pointer over any one of the eight resizing marks, which are either circles or squares, that are located around the perimeter of the image. Once your mouse pointer turns into a double pointed arrow, you can click and drag in either direction displayed in order to increase or decrease the size of the image. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.